Another one for the women out there from Van Cleef and our pals. Let's go. Hey YouTube Fragrance family, welcome to another initial impression on a sample on the women's aisle. This is a brand new Van Cleef and Arpels from the first line. And this line is huge for Van Cleef and Arpel, apparently. Um, this is an EDP concentration. Um, this is a sample that I got when purchasing fragrances. Um, so I love giving my first take on women's fragrances when I can. Um, it does say timeless elegance of a sparkling bouquet made of jasmine petals and frangipani blossom. Central addiction of intense bourbon vanilla. I'm a huge fan of bourbon vanilla, so we'll see. Infused with creamy sandalwood. So sandalwood, always a great note to, uh, to soften up a scent. And an irresistibly delicious signature. So is this going to go gourmand on me or what? Um, so let's see. So first, um, I believe this is the 2016 release from Van Cleef and Arpel. Uh, I believe so. So let's see. Um, this is a flanker of first, I believe, is the uh, initial fragrance. So let's uh, put it on here. I'm not going to put on my skin today. Um, I'm doing uh, multiple initial impressions today. Three sprays. Um, again, keep it tuned in. I will... Whoa. Floral. Um, keep it tuned in. Um, I will do a sampling samples. I will wear this. My wife's going to wear this. And then I'm going to do a sampling samples on that. And then we'll see if we get a bottle to review the fragrance. So, initial impression. Oh. Oh, that's nice. A um, little bit of citruses, but the first thing that hits my nose is the vanilla. And uh, if you are... Uh, you know a subscriber of mine especially the women out there um, you know I love my vanilla based fragrances especially the darker ones um, this is a soft pillowy vanilla it, it does have that uh, vanilla bourbon feel to the fragrance um, a very uh, typical vanilla use um, in fragrances really nice uh, florals white florals in this fragrance uh, I don't it says jasmine right um, yeah and I can smell that Frangipani, yes, uh, Blossom. I'm not smelling much sandalwood here, but uh, more in the dry down, I would assume. Uh, but really, in a nutshell, tinge of hit uh, citrus, vanilla-based scent, uh, with a uh, good dose of white florals, uh, the Blossom, obviously. Decent. Um, I really think for women's fragrance, there's a lot of these women's fragrances that are doing this. Um, there's This is nothing new to my nose that I'm going to be all excited. I can't wait for my wife to wear. Does it smell nice? Yes. Um, do I see my male counterparts wearing this? No. This is your typical woman's fragrance. Um, the, the florals used in here I don't think would be meant for a man. Um, there's a lot of jasmine. Not in this, but uh, jasmine-based fragrances in the men's aisle. But uh, um, I think it's the uh, Fragapani that uh, really turns it more into a feminine fragrance. So, yeah. And you're getting a little bit of the, um, um, the sweetness, either from the vanilla bourbon or the jasmine. The jasmine does, jasmine does give out a, a little bit of sweetness. Overall... Not a bad scent. I don't think uniqueness is going to win anything uh, in regards to that. Uh, but Van Cleef & Arpel is a brand that I highly regard. Um, decent release in 2016, uh, but I don't think it's anything new in the women's aisle. So this is so first, my first impression on it. Please comment below if you are new to my channel, especially the women out there that are searching this on YouTube. Hopefully I you subscribe to this channel. Um, and uh, I will be doing much more first impressions on, on women's fragrances more and more. Um, I'm going to have full-fledged reviews on some women fragrances. So keep it tuned in. I'm going to do my best to cater of the women out there. Um, so this is. So first, comment below again if you smelt this. Uh, good, bad uh, comments. I love hearing different takes. And of course, if you're new to this channel, please comment below and encourage me as a reviewer for mostly men's fragrances uh, to say hey you know what you have an audience if you keep doing these kind of things so I really appreciate that so I know that I can see oh, okay it's worth doing these kind of fragrance reviews or little initial impressions like this thanks for watching have a good one